the BBC Home and Forces Programme. The German war is at an end. We all want to help one another. Human beings are like that. We want to live by each other's happiness, not by each other's misery. We must build a kind of United States of Europe. This world has room for everyone, and the good earth is rich and can provide for everyone. I think this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Here's Radio Luxembourg. It was this amazing triumph. She flew on the edge of space at twice the speed of sound, outrunning even military jets. We must learn to live together as brothers, or we will all perish together as food. What we are building is a community of collective human endeavor. To achieve by cooperation, and which we could not possibly hope to realize in isolation. If you put your mind to it, you can accomplish anything. No matter what anybody tells you, words and ideas can change the world. And let us never forget that the aftermath of war produced two great ideas which have shaped our destiny ever since. One was the NATO alliance, the other the European community. Tear down this wall. These are the aircraft that will be taking millions of business people to work and families on holiday throughout Europe well into the 21st century. Facts, evidence, reason, logic, an understanding of science, these are good things. These are qualities you want in people making policy. I shall have no hesitation in recommending it to Parliament and to the British people. I think that we're definitely moving closer and closer together. Yes, Cantona! Denmark's dream has become reality. Historic day at Stormont after two years of talks and after a generation of bloodshed and decades of division and acrimony, George Mitchell ushers in what the whole island hopes will be a new era of peace. To declare Terminal 5 ready for business. This is the year 2005, not 1945. We're not fighting each other anymore. These are our partners, they're our colleagues, and our future lies in Europe. I'm European champion, so I'm not one of, of the bottle. I'm a, I think I'm a special one. Breathed in red. Genius at work! His name is Thierry Henry. The world is more interconnected than ever before. And it's becoming more connected every day. Building walls won't change that. Liverpool, the capital city of culture. You should have more of these things. That the Nobel Peace Prize for 2012 is to be awarded to the European Union. At least if you can see a blue flag, you can be sure that certain standards will be met. This large antenna is receiving signals transmitted by GOVA, the first Galileo satellite. The European Space Agency has chosen the British Paralympic sprinter John McFall as the first astronaut with a disability to join the space training team. I'd like to add my congratulations to everybody involved in this tremendous achievement. For London's new super sewer. Good morning and welcome to your new Elizabeth Flying Station. This means that the UK has voted to leave the European Union. Still not a week goes by, I don't regret it. And I guarantee a week won't go by in your life, you won't regret walking out. And this is the greatest moment in the modern history of our great nation. Thank you. Nothing in this country works anymore. It seems in the UK, many can't afford to love it. Figures show there are now more food banks in this country than branches of McDonald's. Brexit has failed. 